so hello everyone and welcome back to the another video in today's video we are going to discuss about the axes and planes so starting with the definition the planes are the surfaces onto which the movement takes place whereas the axes are an imaginary lines around which the movement takes place so let us clear this topic with an example for example if you are doing any movement for example you are doing abduction and adduction movement so the movement is taking place onto an imaginary surface that is the plane and the movement is taking around an particular axis or an imaginary line which passes through the joint this is called an axis so the planes are the surfaces onto which the movement takes place whereas the axis are an imaginary line around which the movement takes place so moving further there are three major types of axis and three major types of planes the planes includes the sagittal plane the coronal plane and the transverse plane whereas the axis includes the sagittal axis the coronal axis and vertical axis sagittal axis so the sagittal axis is an axis which lies parallel to the sagittal suture of the skull the movements which takes place around the sagittal axis takes place in the coronal plane it includes the movements such as abduction and adduction of the extremities secondly we have the coronal axis the coronal axis is an axis which lies parallel to the coronal suture of the skull the movements which takes place around the coronal axis takes place in the sagittal plane it, it includes the movements such as flexion and extension of the extremities lastly we have the vertical axis so the vertical axis is an axis which lies along with the line of gravity of our body the movements which takes place along the line of gravity that is the vertical axis takes place in the transverse plane it includes the movements such as internal and external rotation of the extremity sagittal plane so the sagittal plane is an plane which divides the body into left and right aspects so the movements such as flexion and extension of the extremities takes place in the sagittal plane secondly we have the coronal plane so the coronal plane is an plane which divides the body into anterior and posterior aspects the movements which takes place in the coronal plane includes the abduction and adduction movements transverse plane so transverse plane is an plane which divides the body into upper and lower aspects the movements which are taking place in the transverse plane includes the internal and the external rotation of the extremities hope this short video about the axis and planes will be beneficial to you if you are having any queries related to this topic then let me know in the comments below so if you are new to the channel do subscribe the channel and also if you like the video then do hit the like button till then meet you in the next video bye bye